People's Pops was founded on a basic principle that the world deserves a better ice pop. We all grew up eating ice pops all summer long during our childhood. We loved them, they were an integral part. And then we grew up, went to the grocery store, tried to recapture that, and popsicles don't taste like what we remember them to. I'm David Carell, one of the co-founders of People's Pops right here in New York City. We make popsicles and shave ice using only the best locally grown fruits and herbs, organic cane sugar, and nothing else. So we start off with excellent ingredients, excellent fruits. We cook the fruits down and usually right there and then it is sweet enough to make into a popsicle. The only difference is when you freeze a popsicle, it kind of dulls some of the sweetness. So we add a uh, touch of a simple syrup we make using organic cane sugar and an herb that we think will match well with the pop. So if we have a red plum, we might add some shiso to it. If we have a strawberry, we might add some tarragon. We want to have a beginning, middle, and an end to our pop. A full spectrum of flavor, we like to call it. So if you have a strawberry rhubarb ginger pop from us, it starts off like that sweet summer strawberry, moves into that nice tart rhubarb, finishes off with a ginger, and that ginger makes you want a little bit more strawberry. So we play by New York City green market rules, which means we get all of our fruits from about a 250 mile radius of New York City. That means when spring starts, we get our strawberries, our rhubarb from Southern New Jersey, and then when fall rolls around, we're getting Concord grapes and beautiful raspberries from upstate New York, Geneva, Finger Lakes region. We have four stores. We're at markets all around New York City. I like to say during the spring, summer, and fall, we are wherever you would want to be when you want a popsicle. We'll find you. Um, waterfront, Smorgasburg, uh, the High Line. Really, we, we try to serve you a pop in a natural habitat while you're walking down the street enjoying a beautiful summer day. It's really amazing to see this today, especially because of our humble beginnings using upside down Dixie cups. We graduated from that to popsicle molds you would buy at Target and where we had to pull the popsicles out one by one. And now we have some excellent equipment that we've invested in that freezes the pops fast, pulls the pops quick, and really kind of refocuses us on just using excellent ingredients and back to the basics of what we started out doing.